Nancy Holland doesn't take her health for granted. After diabetes ravaged her kidneys, a transplant saved her life. But the medication she takes to prevent organ rejection has led to another medical problem, skin cancer. I was the kind that when you went on picnics, I got blistered the first 10 minutes and I had to sit under the umbrella and I would get blistered under the umbrella. Not only is a sunburn painful, but too much sun can actually damage DNA, which can lead to non-melanoma skin cancer. These cancers behave much more aggressively and are much more likely to uh, metastasize or spread to distant parts of the body. Researchers hope this experimental cream it's called really dimerosine will help patients like Ms. Holland. It contains a bacterial enzyme that makes repairs to damage DNA. We all have this enzyme in our bodies, but because they are immunosuppressed, transplant patients don't have the same protection. What we hope is that by applying um, a bacterial enzyme that also um, repairs damaged DNA, we can um, reduce the number of abnormal cells and in so doing we can reduce the incidence of skin cancer. Patients in the study apply the cream daily for one year. They don't know if they have the actual drug or a placebo. Dermatologists routinely check for any changes or new lesions. Ms. Holland says she's happy to be in the study and for the opportunity to educate others. I use the sunscreen, sunblock, anything. I stay under the shelter. I wear a hat. My skin is just, just too important.